Hey all, I'm about to release a series of interviews I did recently in Switzerland at Keto Live 2022, a superb low carb keto conference focused on chronic disease resolution. So amazing speakers, professors, doctors nearly across the board. And the first interview I have is on a very, very interesting new treatment for cancer which is obviously a massive problem in the world. And it's called ferroptosis, and it takes advantage of a peculiarity of cancer cells and may make them very vulnerable to this new treatment. So Dr. Jean-Pierre Spinoza gave a great talk. I caught him on my balcony and I interviewed him. So here we go through very quickly the basics of this really promising new treatment, which already has in vitro and other experimental validation. So one to watch and last thing please wait till the end especially all you doctors and medical professionals i know how you guys and gals love cme credits well keto from last year keto live has got a full online training program where you simply watch the fantastic talks and then you answer some basic questions to validate and you get up to 86 cme credits and believe me the material is a joy to watch it's not even work so at the end and in the description box below i have the links to that fantastic training program online at your own pace uh, which garners up to 86 cme credits but with that let's go ahead and talk to dr jean-pierre spinoza on a new treatment for cancer it's thursday morning here at keto live 2022 in burgoon switzerland and i'm delighted to have met uh, dr jean-pierre spinoza who is specializing in keto but a specialized keto to target a certain pathway in cancer. Uh, so maybe we just start off with you. You gave a great talk yesterday, but maybe paraphrase or summarize this, this process that you are targeting. Absolutely, Igor. Thank you very much for this interview. In fact, the message that I wanted to give yesterday at the conference is uh, to give to the people the basic to understand this new concept about ferroptosis. What is ferroptosis? Ferroptosis means death by iron. In fact, what happens is that iron uh, uh, cancer cells, they are absolutely full of iron, much more than normal cells. It is said that they have about uh, 1000 times more iron inside them. And you can use this addiction that cancer cells have for iron to trigger uh, oxidative stress, because as you know, iron can be oxidated. And if you achieve this oxidation, you can selectively kill the cancer cells without harming the normal one. So this process is biochemically speaking a little bit complicated, yeah. but when you understand the pathways which allows you to trigger ferroptosis, it was the conference of yesterday, you can understand how to improve the next generation, the future generation of cancer treatments. Because ferroptosis works alone, but works also with chemotherapy at the same time and with radiotherapy. Right, so there's, there's even possibly a positive synergy there. I mean, they really work yes. together. Okay. Yes, yes. The, the problem is that it is a little bit difficult to understand, uh, to, not to understand, to answer with, uh, with security because we don't have studies big enough to exactly uh, know what is the efficiency of these uh, new techniques. That's why I was t telling you that we are in a completely new field. Right, but that in itself <coughs> is exciting, of course, especially if the biochemistry is both complicated and compelling, which it certainly sounds it is. We, we won't go into detail here, I'd say. And you, I suppose, at a Petri dish level, I mean, there is some demonstration of targeting cells, but maybe not in human or in, in there, vivo? There, there, are, there are in vitro demonstrations mm. that it works. And we have now some little studies and some case report of final stage cancer, stage four metastatic cancer, in which ferroptosis show great results. 
Oh, that's excellent because all great new technologies start with case histories, single cases, I mean, in fairness. And you know, it's interesting, I got into the health sphere 10 years ago because I had high ferritin and my doctor couldn't explain why and I found out it was metabolic syndrome. Uh, but ferritin, I've, I've been through quite a lot, but and generally as a, a toxic or pathological problem in the body through oxidation. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's just fascinating now in the cancer topic to see that being used in a positive way. Against, again, against again. the cancer. Yes. No, I, I love elegance and science, you know, and, and poetic justice. So the next steps are, over the next couple of years, I, I would guess, one thing I want to mention is that you are using a ketogenic diet, but that's not your primary focus. It's a ketogenic diet using specific fats to enable and enhance this process. Yes, because if, we, if you go back to the biochemical processes which triggers ferroptosis, you must understand that this oxidation of iron will oxidate the fats that are on the cancer cell membrane and the fat that are on the mitochondrial membrane. But to be able to be oxidated, the fats that are on the membranes should be of a certain type. And they should be poly unsaturated fatty acids. And the best one is omega-3. The less they are unsaturated, and the less they are sensible to ferroptosis. The, the saturated fatty acid, pre which, are, which can be present in the membrane, they are not susceptible to ferroptosis. You must have unsaturated and better polyunsaturated and better omega-3 polyunsaturated fatty acids. So you should prepare the field before triggering the ferroptosis during some days, maybe some week before, mm. you should charge the cancer cells with omega-3 fatty acid. So the field is ready for the moment you trigger the ferroptosis. Excellent, and that's actually, you've put it very clearly there. I know it's a much more complex process at deeper levels, but that is really clear. And for keto people in general, I mean, there will be a, a general understanding that excess omega-6 and excess polyunsaturates with double bonds in your membranes is not generally a good thing. Omega-3 is good, but maybe not excess in general, but we're talking about a specific targeting. And, and during a very short, uh, charge up. Uh, yes, the, 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 the time during which you, you, you trigger this phenomenon of, of ferroptosis is not so long. We're talking about 10 days. All right, and there's enough cell turnover, well, probably especially with the cancer cells, to, to replenish with, with omega 3 in the membrane. 10 days gets quite a lot in there, I, yes, I guess. Yes, yes, absolutely. Yeah. That is an excellent explanation, and I know you are running uh, really quickly to get a train or a plane or... No, I, I, I have my train. All right, very Five good. Five hours and a half of train, but it's nice. Oh, well, I got two and a half hours to the airport, collect my wife, an hour and a half to burn to meet with Professor Bita Stadler. I think he's quite famous here in Switzerland. Switzerland, we know him. Yeah. Nice guy. And then back up here to Burgoon. So we're going to definitely catch you at the next ones, though, because you're going to be with Keto Live at the next conference and, and bringing this knowledge because new knowledge is very hard to, to get into existing communities. So I guess that's your challenge too, is to continue to... I work, I work, I work essentially uh, in cancer in the field of what is called repurposed drugs because we have a lot of molecules uh, which have been uh, registered for other things mm. but that in fact has a, let's say, secondary effect. They are absolutely useful and very strong against cancer and and the goal is to take these molecules and to study them in the field of cancer and for example for this ferroptosis there are a lot of molecules for example metformin for example sulfasalazine for example ibuprofen etc etc that are part of the protocol of ferroptosis excellent so leveraging and repurposing even off patent drugs yes. so the costs will be ultimately low when you successfully develop and deploy this excellent process yes yes, yes. thank you so much Jean thank you, great job see you soon Hi. 
Okay, all, I hope you enjoyed that uh, brief interview and fascinating stuff. And as I said, the links are down below, but also you can see on the screen here, the homepage to get 86 CME credits. Uh, some are English and some are in German, in fairness, uh, but their products are available now. You can do it at your own pace anytime up to, I think, 2024. And all of the validation and credentials are all signed off for these European and US CME credits. So watch out for future broadcasts where I go into detail on Keto Live 2022, which will also have all of its material available with a new raft of CME credits and fantastic talks throughout. So, till next time, guys, thank you.